All right, so when you are repairing your gel coat and trying to bring a new polished finish to it, the first thing you want to do is start with 600 grit. And I suggest you do that all by hand because you don't want to burn through the gel coat with a orbital sander of some sorts. So you don't want to do that. So I start with the 600 grit by hand. And then you go to your 800 grit. Then you go to 1,000 grit, 1,200 grit. Finish with the 1,500 grit, you know, all sanded. And uh, then you hit it with the buffing wheel and then hit it with the speed wax. I suggest, I got all these tools from Harbor Freight. You can get a, a buffer and sander. There's your orbital sander you can get from Harbor Freight. Your buffer, you know, you get, I got from Harbor Freight and all the compound and everything. And so, uh, after that you want to polish it you know that was the polishing wheel on there and so that's the steps on doing it and uh i'll try to do a time lapse never done one i'll try to do a time lapse of me doing it it's the uh, it's already kind of broken up a little bit uh it's kind of fading already gel coat's almost gone so our finish ain't gonna be great and uh, i gotta be real careful that i don't burn the rest of the way through if you burn through too far It'll start getting really shiny, especially in the uh, metal flake areas. So you don't want to, you know, I'm going to have to be real careful and be tedious with this uh, job because it's already pretty well faded. And, but uh, I'll uh, do the steps and, and uh, we'll see how well I can uh, uh, get it to pop back alive. So here's our finished product here, doing it, our method that I just showed. It's decent. It could be better. Like I said, some of the gel code coat is faded in certain areas, so it's harder to tell. Something I forgot to mention is, is you got to use water when you're sanding. It's a wet sand process, and that's all it takes. There, guys, a little bit of elbow grease and about three hours of work uh on that top side so you know typically it takes me about oh probably i got down to about 10 9 to 10 hours you go too fast and your results end up not being too good so you want to take your time and make sure you do a good job if you're going to do it so it could have been better it's faded a little bit but all in all i think it'll be good to go and We'll move on to the rest of the boat.